Welcome back to Final Fantasy 16. Last time we started taking down some of our hunts and we came to see at the blacksmith if we could uh, build the Goddard Amarong weapon, but we're one, uh, what is it, dark steel, I think? I don't know, we're, we're one, one MacGuffin short. So we're going to double check these locations. Actually, first, we're going to check in with the, the uh, what is it, the Alliant Report? Clive. Yeah. Here you go. We'll check in here, see if there's anything new. No, nothing. Always something in there. I think we're 20... How may I help you today, Clive? 20 renowned short? Yeah, 20 renowned short to get the Genji gloves. Luck out there, Sid. So we'll double check these. I think we only have the two hunts. And then I'm expecting there's probably going to be a final three that open up. Because I can't see them leaving those three blank spaces there. Unless they just do, which would be weird, but... Okay, so Half Comb and Critten Hollow. So let's pop over here. Uh, where is Half Comb? Down here. So let's go... Uh, it'd be closer from here. I'm expecting it'll probably be here or here or or just along the path but so let's head here we'll jump on birdo and then after we take down this hunt uh depending on how much renown we get we may go get the genji glove if it's available if if Foster. if we get 20 renown oh oh whoa whoa game game chill man Interesting, interesting, um, very, very distinct lack of music. Oh, there, right as I say it. Okay, let's see if it's up here. Nope, that was a treasure box. Oh my god, these, these long, narrow hallways were not made with Birdo in mind. Because, like... If you haven't played this yet by this point and you're watching now, this bird has the, the same controls as, um, like, oh, I guess our hunt is here. Um, our, our terror chicken has the same controls as the Crash Bandicoot 3 motorcycle, <laughs> which is to say it's horrible. Okay, we can go get the Genji glove after this. So that that's perfect. All right, nice, nice throwback to one of the first bosses in the game. Ow! Oh my, where, what? But, yep, this is, uh, I think this is the third or fourth time we fight this particular enemy. Like, this is a reskin, obviously, but... This is, uh, this enemy, they, they lifted this straight out of Diofield Chronicle. There we go. Are we going to fit another one in? Are we going to fit another one in? Ah, not quite. There we go. Get wrecked. Ah, 
Ow! How did we counter that? I mean, whatever. I'm not going to complain, but... It just seems weird to counter that, like, bounce attack. <laughs> Okay, we'll get one of these out so we can start shredding that stagger gauge again. Almost got him. Almost halfway. Ow. Ow. Almost got him. Yeah, shred that health bar. There we go. All right. Dang, 15 and a half thousand. I love it. And we got a level. I really hope, I, I sincerely hope the level cap in this game is not 50. That would be so disappointing. But, like, had it. Okay, there's the stone tongue that we need for uh, one of our crafting things. I've had warmer welcomes. Um, yeah, if, if the level cap in this game is 50, that would be super disappointing. But, like, there's it's not like there's necessarily anywhere you can go grind. And it's not like there's any real reason that you'd need to. It's just, I hate seeing the hard limit at 50. They did the same thing in Final Fantasy VII Remake. Well, the, the first part. I can't I can't speak to the second part yet because we, we don't know. But I would imagine, based on how the first part went, that they're probably going to have level 50 be the, the limit of levels in part 2, so... Today, I, I don't know why they would go with that, but... Sorry, but you're not quite oh, ready. okay, never mind. We can't get the Genji Glove. We're, we're about 100 off. <laughs> My bad. I may have more for you. My bad. Getting a little ahead of myself there. Okay, so I think we have just the... Okay, so there's just this one left, and this is in Critten Hollow. So let's pop over to... Here... Uh, Critten Hollow is okay. So we'll grab that on the way to on the way to our side quest. Oh, why did I why did I exit out? Okay, so we'll go in. We'll run through town again, and we'll see what uh, what what happens now. And I guess story wise, but we'll we'll take down multiple birds with one stone today because we're just gonna. It's like bowling. We're going to take down all the pins in order. We'll do story, hunt, side quest, and then hopefully by that time we have enough renown to get the Genji Glove, because I'm really curious to see what kind of what kind of stats that, that's got, or if, if it comes with any like special effect. Because usually the Genji Glove is like a cool thing. But, like, according to the home screen, we're, like, uh, the last time I looked, I think it said we're 92% done. So, we're like, we're on the home stretch. Very, very much so. I'm not going to bother jumping on Birdo. Yeah, no, because we have to get off to open this anyway. <laughs> Push that gate. Wow, that's cool. That is a very Im imposing You're structure. The capital. Is through that gate. 
just as you surmise. Very imposing structure. I and like it. Army down there, Josh. I approve. Yes. <clears throat> but I don't see any dominance. There's no dominance because we have all the, the icons. Except for Leviathan. They mentioned Leviathan, but Fly Ambrosia. It would appear that Leviathan does not exist yet. Maybe possibly as part of DLC later. But currently, nope. Okay, well, this is kind of cool. Oh, really, game? Oh, cool. Okay, we got an amber. Sells for money that we're not going to necessarily use on anything. This is a really cool little area. Oh, hi. Was not expecting enemies to just phase in like that. Yeah, really neat little area. Can we go up there? No, eh? Okay, well let's uh, let's call Birdo back. I, I don't think we're gonna find too much around this area. It's just they they give you these big open areas, but like there's no there's no actual motivation to just like explore because there's no like there's no like side dungeons or anything. Like there, it's cool to look at for story purposes, but. Realistically, like, there's no... Aw, oh, come on, game. Okay, meteorite. I guess later on, we'll, we'll just... We'll have to go to the blacksmith and just craft literally everything so that we have one of everything. <laughs> because we have so many materials that, like... <laughs> like, what else are you supposed to do with them? And that's why I was saying before, like, it's it's almost like the, the crafting system was almost pointless. Unless they have, like, a major DLC expansion where they add, like, story content, they add icons, they add new equipment... Um, in if the level cap is 50, increase it to 100. Oh, there's an actual like story thing here. Not an unturned soldier in sight. Can we aggro the, the terror chickens? We can! Oh, we totally whiffed that. I thought I was still on Shiva. counter
Ah, we haven't seen one of these guys in a bit. There's the stagger. Yeah, we're just gonna take him out normally. There, there's no point using any more abilities. There he goes. Is that it? Or are we gonna get a mini boss? Oh, another wave. Oh, and a big boy. Should have saved our diamond dust. Wow, what an observant guy Clive is. <laughs> Josh, this guy's bigger. <laughs> Like seriously, Clive, we took down we took down a dragon the, the size of a house, and you're gonna complain about this guy being bigger and make it sound like this is like some crazy thing? Like, come on, man! There we go. Perfect timing for that. <clears throat> Come on, get the stagger. There we go. There we go. Wow, 11,000 experience. 470 ability points. Dang. Well, I guess that makes sense. We took down a lot of enemies there. We can rest here if you like. Just hacking out a, the entire lung. Okay, so let's see what we can do. Um... These are a thousand each, so we can, we can, uh, mm, that's the thing. Like I have a hard time justifying mastering a lot of this stuff because once you, like you only really have to upgrade it. You don't have to master it unless you want to like have a mix and match icon set up. Like, so like what does master do for this? Increases maximum kicks to two. What about this? Increases lunge or imbues blade with fire, increasing ability, potency, and range. Eh. Lunge probably increases distance. Increases lunge distance. Um, you know what? Let's learn these. Why not, right? Completely forgot about Odin. I'll be fine. Okay, so let's uh, head up through the door, I guess.
not seeing any treasury boxes around here. I don't think there necessarily would be out here. Maybe, maybe in here. Is that a treasure box? Yes, it is. Okay, crafting materials we probably won't use. Okay, nothing else. Let us go through. Look, Clive. By the founder. The place is a fortress. Absolutely. You'd think they would have expected that, having come through this gigantic place structure that basically is just there to act as a gate. Like, I mean, if this is what they build... To be like, oh yeah, we're going to put up a gate. If that's what they build, then yeah, I would fully expect the main castle to be an entire fortification. Oh, what? Invisible Oh. That was strange. We can go up the ladder? No? Okay. Let's check out this side. Game, you can't build gigantic areas like this and not put a treasure box in it. You just, you can't do it. It's weird. Oh, this is where our hunt is. Um, does it matter which way we go down? Oh, is that our hunt over there? This place is freaking massive. Oh no, those are just enemies. I'm curious what's over here, so I kind of want to go see. We'll just use all of the things. Freeze! Oh, a lich! Cool! Thank you. 
I think this should do it. Well, maybe not that, but I mean, pretty dang close. That'll do it though. Okay, so let's let's uh, come over here first. You know, it's, it's kind of a shame they have this big, gigantic, massive, insane open area, and they're like, there's, like, outside of the enemies, there's like, pretty, it's like there's nothing here. <laughs> what do you suppose that is? It's not on Vivian's map. Probably for a good reason. Right. Just down here. Uh, okay, so there's... I would presume there's going to be something here later. Um, I don't know if it's going to be story-wise, or if it's going to be like DLC, or if it's going to be a hunt, but... going to be something. Okay, let's go, Birdo. This place is too big to uh, on. run on foot. Foster. Um, okay, so I'm, I'm not even going to bother going down there. We're just going to go straight into here. Um, and we'll come up to the side quest thing. And hopefully somewhere in here we run into our hunt. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. That would be ideal. No villages. No knights. Not even any bodies. Yeah, no, just a Welcome massive, the whole kingdom turn to absolutely gigantic, completely unused space, other than a hunt and a side quest. <laughs> a hunt, a side quest, and a main quest destination. You know, this part of the game kind of, aside from the enemies on the map, it, it kind of gives me like um, Shadow of the Colossus vibes. You got like just big open space with nothing in it. Oh, that's our hunt. Okay, that works. But yeah, like in Shadow of the Colossus, you have just like the entire world and the only enemies that you find on it are just the big, the, the Colossus. That, like that's it.
There we go. Wow, Mr. Pepper went Super Saiyan. There we go. Almost got him. This should do him in, I think. There we go. Okay, so that takes care of all of our hunts for now. Yeah, we're 50, 50 short. Wow, 16,000. Holy crap, we're almost at 200,000 gil. Dang, dude. Let's hope it was the last of its kind. Okay. So that was fun. Yeah. Um, oh, we got to go around. Because that is very clearly a wall. Well, that was lame. Oh, that's one of those bomb guys. And there's our side quest done. He'll be able to see all the way to stone here. You know, I wasn't paying attention to what we got from uh, when we beat that last hunt. Like item wise, I, I wasn't paying attention if we got like a um, any of the the any man could hope for. materials. I'll take a look in the menu after. I don't I don't know if we can actually look at items. All right, 30 renown. We are 20 short for the Genji Glove. Got some Clutch Mine. 
Okay, so let's see. Items? Ah, okay, materials. Yeah, we still need one more one more dark steel. What was that? Yeah, I'm not I'm not seeing anything. I think we're I think we're done for now. Man, this scene, this feels like the scene right at the end of uh, when you beat Castlevania and you got like the, at the credits when you see like the gravestone and it's all like silhouette and stuff and you got like the castle in the background. Very, very Castlevania-esque. Very fitting considering that we've been playing through the game almost exclusively as Gabriel Belmont. <laughs> but um, I think we'll call it there for now. And next time, I'm kind of curious what that is over there. Like if that's like the remnants of a town or something. But we'll make our way over to the, the Mother Crystal and see what else we can unlock. If there's any more hunts, any more side quests, whatever. So if you like this video, make sure you hit the like button. And if you want to see more videos like these, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And until next time, thanks for watching.